Did you know that Live Pigeon works with ClickFunnels? Yes, you can embed your video once, and then every time you go live, it will automatically update your ClickFunnels page over and over and over. This is extremely useful for webinars and different sales videos. Today, let's get into it and show you how you can do this for yourself. First, let's go to Live Pigeon and let's get our smart embed code link. To do this, we're going to log into Live Pigeon, and once you're on the dashboard, make sure you're connected to Facebook and or YouTube, depending on where you want to embed your live from. Once you've connected to your destinations, go up here to your account and click Smart Embed. Now that we're in our Smart Embed settings, what we need to do is copy the link. Now you're going to see YouTube videos on here and Facebook pages appearing. What this means is anytime you go live to any one of these destinations, this Smart Embed link will update. For this example, we're going to be embedding directly from our YouTube channel. So we'll go over here and click Copy. Now that we've got the link, let's embed this onto our website. The next step is to embed this onto our ClickFunnels page. In order to do this, I have a blank ClickFunnels editor here in front of me. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and create a new row. I'm going to add just a single column. And I'm going to go over here to the miscellaneous tab on the right. And I'm going to select custom JavaScript or HTML. Now that this code is inserted, let's select it and click open code editor. Inside of here, this is where we're going to want to paste our embed code. So let's go ahead and right click and click paste. Now that the link is in there, I want to note that ClickFunnels requires this link to be broken out into two. So up here we can see we've got a div, ID, class, and then it ends the div. That's one section right there. The next section is our script section. It starts with a script tag and ends with a script tag. We can see if we hit enter, we can space them out. And you can see they both start with this symbol right here. We're going to go ahead and take this script tag and we're going to right click and cut from our page. So the only thing that should be in our custom HTML element right now is the div with the ID and with the class. Next, we're going to go ahead and close this window. We're going to go to our settings, tracking code, and we're going to paste that code that we just copied. Right click, paste. Now, what's kind of cool is if we have multiple embed videos, you don't need to do this multiple times. One script is more than enough here in your tracking code. But what this does is this custom element says, hey script, this is where my video is. So you can now put this wherever you want on the page. If you had a second column, let's go ahead and add a new row and add two columns. We could put this over here and the Smart Embed link will now appear in this window. It's important to note, we've seen some users that will try and add an element and they'll try to add a video. And inside the video, they might go to custom embed and paste the Smart Embed link. This is the wrong way to do it, and you will run into a lot of issues by trying to do that. And so for the best and simplest experience, we highly recommend just sticking to the custom JavaScript or HTML element. Now that we've got the page all set up, let's go ahead and click Save and Preview. And as you can see, the page loads and we see a video playing here. This was the last video that was live on our channel recently, so this is what's pulling up. Now, if we go back into Live Pigeon and go ahead and go live, we should see that video update. Let's try it now. If we go to our dashboard and let's disconnect from Facebook, we're only going live to YouTube here and we'll go live now. We'll give it a video title. For this example, I'm just going to go ahead and put testing to click funnels because it doesn't need to be fancy. And for privacy reasons, we're going to set this to unlisted. Now that we've done that, let's go ahead and click next. And we've already uploaded the video in advance to our incubator. So we're going to select the incubator and we're going to choose this video right here. Now, let's see the magic happen on the next page. Once this pigeon completes and we see this in our completed area, our page will automatically update too. Your message has been successfully carried to YouTube. Awesome. And let's go back to our ClickFunnels page and let's check it out. And just like that, you can see that we are live right now. Our video automatically updated. It's live as we're going. And you can see testing to ClickFunnels, there's our title and everything is working perfectly, just the way that it should. Isn't that awesome? Now that this video is live, once the video is finished, it will either default to whatever your settings are, or it will keep this video on the page. And that's it. That's how Smart Embed works going live to ClickFunnels.